And welcome back everybody once again to Ragecraft, the corrupted path rules the matter. I am TJ the Obscure here with you and we are back here at the Nexus ready to choose a new rule for this episode. The rule, um, I think this is, this is, oh, I forgot to number those, six, seven, this is rule number eight. Rule number eight, and I don't really know what to call it. Um, it was suggested by Tiwi on the... Uh, I think I'm going to call it Black Magic. Um, it was suggested by Tiwi on the CTMC Discord. Tiwi, like, so I think it was suggested somewhat as a joke. But the general idea is that I can't use swords or bows to attack my foes. Hey, that rhymes. I, I don't need these arrows then, do I? Uh, but yeah, I cannot use swords or bows, so our only weapon that we've found thus far is the Sharpness 2 Knockback 3 Fire Aspect 2 Black Magic Book. I guess I could use axes, but <clears throat> I'm going to stick with the book, I think. Um, and it frees up uh, a thing on my hotbar so I can have dual health potions now, so I guess that helps a little bit. Uh, and let's see, here. You, you know what? If there's one thing that, and oh, also this is only going to be a one episode rule, otherwise it'll just get way too difficult. But um, if there's one thing that I hate about this map, it's the layout. The layout is really confusing. Like, I was thinking that because the monument is in Venom Grove, that that would end, end up kind of being the central area and all the, all the areas would connect to it. But I, it seems like the Nexus is supposed to serve that purpose. But the monument is in Venom Grove. It just it, it doesn't make much sense to me. So it's like, should I stick with my house in Venom Grove, my ugly house that I built, or should I come back to the Nexus and just just make this my permanent base? I think it makes more sense to have the Nexus as my permanent base, um, and that also means that we can blow up the house in Venom Grove. Uh, although just traveling to the monument is kind of a pain. Kind of a pain. I had to go all the way back to, uh, oh, oh, you know, I didn't even think about that. We could have, <laughs> we could have made some puppies, had done a little inbreeding with Bello the second and Bello the first. Uh, I don't think the puppies would be as strong, but it would have given us more soldiers to work with. Um, but unfortunately we can't do that now because... Poor Bella the First is dead. I think uh, what I'm going to do eventually is go back to that area with the crazy baby spiders. I think it's Infested Roots is the name of the area. And build like a little memorial to Bella the First. And we're also just going to blow that area up. Uh, it kind of depends on how much TNT I, I can find. And I think I might make an exception for the no crafting rule in that the only thing that I can craft is TNT. But I'll wait to hear your guys' thoughts on that. Um, Alright, we're headed to Brimstone Isle. Yeah, I went all the way back, got Bella the Second, and Bella the Second, I think, can follow us out here now. Uh, yep, there's Bello. Brimstone Isle. Uh, this book that I have is not a good weapon. It, it'll make an okay defensive weapon because of the knockback three. But other than that, gosh, that's a good sword, too. But we'll have to have to hold on on that. Um, so yeah, it should make a decent defensive weapon. And I'm pretty sure last episode I said I was going to go... I mean, there's this chest right here. But I think I said that I was going to go to uh, to this building over in this direction. And it might make sense... Well, I see a spawner down here. Let's see what we're what we're dealing with. Oh gosh, dang it. No, 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 that's a, that's a health potion. I just remembered, I, I have no bow. I have no bow, so I cannot, cannot really shoot these guys with my bow, can I? Let's go and get another health potion on the bar. Where, where did they go? Oh, they're all the way out, out there in the lava. Wow. Okay. Um, let's just go, uh-oh, uh-oh. You know what I just realized, you guys? I just realized that, oh, come on, come on, really? Uh-oh. 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 Alright, run away. Run away. Run away. Oh, man. I'm not going to be able to set off the TNT because I do not have... I guess I could make a flint and steel. Um... But, yeah. Whatever. <laughs> 
Whatever. We're just not going to be able to blow things up, I suppose. Uh, can we do that? And then get up on the fence post itself. Uh-oh. I don't know if Bellow's going to be able to take them out or not. It looks like he's doing all right. Just do not kill my other dog. Otherwise, we may have to end up leaving Bellow behind. Um, let's see if he can actually take them out. The pigmen, because they have the, the better reach, you know? Uh-oh. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go. There is a thing right there. There is a skelly. There is a skelly. And there are lots and lots of pigmen spawners. Oh, gosh dang it. Gosh dang it. Alright, fine. I don't know where he went. Well, I am nearly out of health potions. Did he fall all the way down? He did. Okay. Oh man, you guys, this oh, those are those are fence posts. Those are fence posts. We need we need blocks. Oh, I can't attack you. I cannot attack you. That's not crab box thing, because I didn't cover up completely. That's the justification I'm using. Alright. Oh man, this area is gonna be interesting. I think this might be an area where it's just running. Just lots of running. Um, creepers we cannot attack. Let's eat some food. I think I may need to go back and get a flint and steel. I don't know. I do not know. Um, Alright. And let's go ahead and do that. And that. And that. And let the, let the creeper blow things up. Creeper, blow it up. Nope, 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 nope. Gosh dang, I was just trying to knock you into the thing. I was just trying to knock you into the thing. Alright, we'll just light it up like so. We have a chest with some replacement armor. That's going to be helpful. Um, I need iron and I need flint is what I need. And is there stuff up on top as well? Or is that all? Gosh dang it. Run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! Lots of spawners. Ooh, there's gold here. I can start ma- Oh, and there's iron, you guys. There's iron! Iron is very nice. Um, let's see here. Can I actually take you guys on? Uh-oh. Not when there's everything else in the world chasing me, huh? Um... Man, there are a lot of spawners, you guys. Oh, and there are lots of pigmen following me, too. Alright, can we just... Um, nope. Okay, not gonna work. Not gonna work. D double tap, double tap, double tap. Double tap. Blaze shooting at me. Things happening. I just need to get some peace and quiet, please. Peace and quiet. Anybody? Where's Bello at? Bello. My, my buddy. Uh... Just hopefully that that skelly forgets about me. My armor's already getting a little low here. Uh, I don't think he forgot about me. Nope. Oh, and there's a creeper right there. Well, he's dead now. He is dead now. All right, you go that way. What was I gonna do? I think I was gonna take some speed, and that's probably good for now. And that way we can just kind of run through this area. Uh. And I, I imagine a lot of these are pigment spawners. Which means light is not going to affect them very much. Oh, jump up the ladder, guy. What are you doing? That's Creeper. Creeper. Is there a way into this place? I guess. Ooh, we have a traitor. Arrows, bottles of XP, a smite four sword. Oh, interesting. Diamond chest plate. Um, oh, and you guys have furnaces. I need to get one of these so that I can cook up some of that iron and make a flint and steel. Is what I need to do. Alright. There's that. Uh, let's see here. Is there any iron nearby? By any chance? I guess we'll just go back. Oh, am I out of torches? Apparently I am. Apparently I am out of the torches. Excuse me, everybody. Coming through. 
coming through. I need to eat the foods. Are they still chasing me? They have forgotten about me. All right, we just need a couple. Um, and we have room in our inventory. Four, five, six. All right, that should be good. And let's see here. Where do we want to go to do this? I don't, even, I don't think I realized there were furnaces right there, too. Um, I already got all that stuff. Anything up on top besides the skelly? I think... Um, oh, I saw diamond pants. I saw diamond pants. I am just... Just so much stuff. No, I needed that gravel. Gosh dang it. Give me the gravel back, please. Um... Man, man, oh, and the gravel is the only thing that fell off. Oh, let's make sure this is well lit. Um, let's see here. Gosh dang it, I need the glass too. Oh, he, pick he picked up my stuff. He picked up my pants. I think Bellow's dead, you guys. This is not good. This is not good whatsoever. Oh gosh. Nope. 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 Run and jump. Run and jump. Uh, we have lost all of the bellows. Oh, this area. This area is intense. Very, very intense. I need some gravel. I need some gravel. And I need to get stuff out of my inventory. No, not you. Not you. Um. Okay. Bello is dead. Or I made Bello sit somewhere. I'm not entirely sure. I need to find myself some gravel, though. Well, that looks interesting. Thankfully, my speed is still going. Here we go. Here's some gravel for me. And then we need to find a place to safely cook up the iron. Um, let's see here. Where is that safe place going to be? I do not know. I'm also kind of hoping to find Bello around here somewhere. Alright, we're just going to do this. We are just going to do this, and we're going to build ourselves a little platform. And we're going to cook up some iron real quick. Alright, alright, that is taken care of. We can now blow up spawners if we need to. I feel like we've made absolutely zero progress. Um, oh, I wonder, that almost looked like fire resist. Regeneration and resistance, actually. Well, that should be helpful. I should find more of those things. I wonder what these pits with the skeleton heads are all about. But I really need to conserve my TNT. Uh-oh. Are you my villager? I think you're my villager and you have escaped. That's not good. That's not good, especially because I can buy diamond from him. But oh well. Oh well. This... This castle looks important. This castle looks very, very important indeed. Uh, yeah, regen and resistance it gives me. It'd be nice if it gave me a little bit of speed, too. Oh gosh dang it, I gotta stop walking right next to the freaking spawners. Uh, there's this big tower right here, but there is also this big castle to the right. Something tells me it's going to be in the big castle if there is indeed a wool. Um, 
Yep, this looks this looks promising. Alright, here's what we're gonna do then. As long as there's no skellies following me. Uh, we're gonna take some more speed and some strength and some regen and get that on the bar. And let's get to it. Let's see if we can grab ourselves a wool this episode. Or if we're just gonna die a terrible, terrible death. I could also see that happening. Uh, water, nothing in it though. Uh, and honestly, the main spawners that we need to take out, I think, are the... Uh, well, that looks interesting. What is this? Greed is a deadly sin, it says. Interesting. I can't blow up the creeper. Um... I can juke the creeper. Alright, we're just going up then. For now, at least. I need to eat. Be gone, Mr. Zombie. Be gone. Dodge. Interesting looking castle, that's for sure. Uh, break you. Light you up. At least a lot of the spawners are not primed, it would seem. Uh, I cannot, cannot do anything about that. Uh, are there invisible creepers? I think that there are invisible creepers, you guys. Which is not good. Not good at all. Alright, we're back out here. Alright, let's get our glowstone on the bar. And let's keep, keep, keep on running. Oh, there's those wither dudes. Okay, we've been in here, but I think that there was a path that we did not take that went upstairs. Yes, indeed. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. All right, let's go up then. And let's light that up. Glowstone might actually work better, especially for how the, how the spawners are arranged in here. Uh, light that up. Going farther up. Farther up we go. And light it up. 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 What is that? Actually, I guess that's technically, uh, that's technically cryboxing, I do believe. We just, we we just got the wool, you guys. We just got the wool. <laughs> I I'm having I'm having a hard time processing that. Why was that's terrible wool placement? Wow. I'm kind of surprised at that one. Um. Yeah. We'll, we'll, uh oh. Okay. We blew it up. We blew it up. We blew it up. We're good. We're good. And what is this? Oh, there's so many interesting things here, you guys. So very many interesting things. Oh, yes, please. Yes, please. Don't mind if I do. Do not mind if I do. I definitely need the blocks and the glass. Although my house, I don't think I'm going to end up completing it anyways. I'm, yeah, I'm really surprised at the wool placement there. Um, de definitely need to do that. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay, run, 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 run. And knock him back. Knock him back. And your silverfish, for whatever reason, uh, I, I can nope, I cannot attack him. Gosh dang it! Okay, um, piece of my armor comes off. Uh, let's see here. What do I want to do here? What do I want to do here? I think I want to do this and that, and maybe dig a little farther back, just to be safe. I'm putting golden apples on. All right, I'm really, I'm really intrigued by what the heck this place is. To be honest with you, oh gosh. All right, light it up. Light it up. We should be able to, I think, just run and jump and light it up. Uh, hallways freaking me out. Very, very scary hallway. Was that supposed to be scary? Was that supposed to trap me? Was that supposed to do something? 
because it did nothing. All right. Clearly, we came down here for no reason whatsoever. Uh, I should probably take the time now to make some more torches, I think. Would be smart. Armor is getting a little low there. All right. Uh, that and that. And golden apples are good. I still got a little bit of speed and a little bit of strength. But let's go ahead and take some more regen as well. Um, there's something else down here, it looks like. Uh, you are just blaze. Alright, and take you out. Oh, we cannot. Uh oh. Okay. Eat the apple then. We will eat the apple. Be gone, Mr. Pigman. Be gone, Mr. Pigman. Just so the blaze cannot attack me. Alright, he's taken care of. This is all silverfish from the looks of it. We need to get over here in the corner so that the skeletons cannot shoot us down. Alright, I think at this point we really just need to get out of here. Is what we need to do. I don't know what the quickest way out of here is going to be, though. Gosh dang it. Gosh dang it, I keep hitting the skeletons, you guys. I keep hitting the freaking skeletons, which means we need to lose another piece of armor. Alright. I have all the wool on me. And you know what that means? I've lost two pieces of armor. That means that it is time to go. That means it is time to leave. Uh, oh, this area, you guys. This area is going to be the death of me. Whew, okay. At this point, I'm kind of tempted to just end the episode so that I can eventually get my uh, get my armor back in the next episode, but I, that would be kind of unfair, I think. We probably have a little bit of time left. Let's see about exploring this tower here we can and we probably just want to go ahead and use another one of those I found regen potions are are by far the most plentiful in the map so I, I'm not I don't feel too bad about using a lot of them uh oh uh oh oh man <sighs> okay okay well at least we died in a relatively safe place um, I'm going to run back and grab my things real quick, and I will meet you guys over there, I think, is what I'm going to do. I don't, I don't have a weapon at this point, though. That's one, one potential problem. All right, let's go ahead and get back in there. Um, I, I have pretty much nothing at this point. I have no, no speed potions, no ender pearls. Uh, a couple of health items, um, but you know, honestly, I think it's in this way. All we really need is a pick and some blocks, and we shall persevere. I am still only wearing the chest piece and the boots because the punishment stays in effect until the end of the episode. Um, man, that dang creeper, you guys. Dang creeper ruined my day. Uh, but yeah, all we really need to do is retrieve, this is one of those potion things, I think. Can we get some of that? Thank you. It may come in handy, you never know. Nope, nope, dodge all the stuff, please. Get up here. Get up here. Pretty, pretty, please. Oop, I hear something coming after me. Alright, and... Grab all the stuff. There is a pigment spawner up above us. Uh, I do... I need to get the chest... Oh, there's the wool right there. I need to get stuff in here. And I think that we need to... Um, should we get that? I'm going to get rid of... Where's my good pick at? Make this just kind of narrow... So that pigmen cannot get up here and 
follow us or anything. Okay, we need, um, I want that, and I want that. Let's go ahead and put that up for safekeeping. And I need my TNT, and I need my flint and steel, which is right there. All right, we need to take out this pigment spawner that's above us. But I'm not really sure what the best way to do that is. I think what I'm going to do is hop over here. First and foremost, and let's just go ahead and get this regen going. Um, and we need to... That seems to work all right. Um, where is the spawner at? Oh, there's a skeleton right there. Are you serious? Um, where's that skelly at? I need to... There we go. Just spleef him. Spleef him. Get that back on the bar. Where or oh, where is the spawner at, you guys? Come on, Mr. Pigman. Come on down. Uh, I guess we'll go ahead and do that. And I think we can break one more safely. I'm afraid that there might be a pigment above me. Where's my magical book at? There it is. Um. Alright, I think we're okay. Let's go ahead and get some more of that regen going. Alright. I need to know. I don't think... Okay, I think we're good. I think we can block up here and... Okay, I, I see... I see where the spawner is. Uh, let's go ahead and do something like that. And something like that. And where's my flint and steel at? I hope that skeleton's not around and knocked me off. Alright, let's just go ahead and blow that up. Whew, okay. Although, that just opened up a gigantic freaking hole. And there are lots and lots of the gas around. Um, ladders? Ladders, anybody? Ladders? There better be something freaking amazing up here. There better be something amazing, and it is the enchanting table. Oh, okay, okay. Alright. Um... We'll take those. I'm just going to go ahead and use them, actually. Well, I have to say, this is this has been one of the, the more exciting episodes for me. And it's definitely one of the more challenging ones. I was pretty much not even able to attack most mobs. With Bellow gone, skeletons and creepers are both entirely off-limits now. Um... Unless we can find more wolves in the map. Alright, and then we need to get down to our chest. There's a lot of pigment down there, you guys. Uh, let's go and get our feather folly on. And I think that we just want to do something like that. Let's block off so that people can't see us. Let's get our better chest plate on. We definitely want that and that. We can put up a lot of this junk. Um, I do want my stake pretty, pretty, please. And some sandstone. We got plenty of ladders. All right, now all we need to do is actually make it out of here alive. Uh, I think I'm gonna take another regen potion. What is out here, exactly? Anybody? I'm tempted to use an ender pearl, but that seems like it would be kind of kind of cheesing it. There's a lot of stuff down there, though. There is a lot, a lot of stuff down there. Um... Well... Can we do something like that? Just so we can maybe get a better running head start. And 
And, uh... Let's get the health potion right there. Alright, let's give it a shot. Run, try to stay away from spawners and whatnot, especially the pigmen. Especially the pigmen. Oh, that guy has a freaking flame bow. Are you serious? Are you serious, people? Alright, nope, do not want them spawning on my head. Okay. Okay. I think we're gonna make it out alive. Uh oh. Uh oh. Maybe not. 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 Uh, thank you for the boost there, guy. Oh, I hate the double tap. I hate the double tap. Double tap is the worst thing ever invented. Whew, okay. Okay. Close the door. Never coming back here ever again. Just kidding, of course. We'll be back here next episode, because I think the path of the next area is in here. Either that or it's in the Caverns of Pestilence. Um, and thankfully, we'll have all of our armor and our weapons back. Next episode. The only thing that we will not get back is is poor poor Bello. Gosh dang it. Lost another dog. Oh, I hope that that episode was was exciting. I hope it was worth it. Um things are really really starting to get crazy, you guys. <laughs> really starting to to get quite quite insane. Um, let's, let's go ahead and run over and places on the monument before we officially end the episode. Alright. Pink wool has been gotten. I kind of wanted that stare, but oh well. Oh well. So we have done six. Still don't know where white wool is. Six wools, which leaves us, we're, I think we're a little more than third way done third of the way done. Bedrock Nether Quartz. Oh, interesting. I didn't know that those were on the monument. Um, that requires Silk Touch, though, right? And I don't know how we were supposed to get Bedrock, but I'm sure we'll figure it out. Alright, you guys. Well, that's going to be it for me for today. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time.